Hey, what's up guys? Lunch Money Mo here. Welcome to the channel and this is session number 29 of the challenge. And like the title of the video says, this is the last session of the series. There will not be a session number 30, so make sure to watch till the end and I hope you guys enjoy. Hey guys, I hope you guys are doing well and having a great day. And welcome to session number 29 of the challenge. I can't believe we made it this far and we're only one session away from the last one. Hopefully we get there. And uh, today's goal is to make $172. Um, I think I'm gonna start off by trying a strategy that I saw from the Roulette Master. It's kind of similar to what I've been doing with the two dozens. It's using two columns instead with some streets. All right, so let's start off the setup. He didn't put a dollar on zero, but since we're covering 26 and 32, I'm gonna change it up and put a dollar on zero. So it's gonna be a total of a $41 bet here. Thing, 26, 22, 22, that's, that's super nice right there. Oh man, so close to 23. All right, so eight is a partial loss. So I'm just gonna rebet. Pretty much just uh, set the bet and leave it. All right, let's get a win here. Twenty-five is good. Let's go. Twenty-five. So we hit the street and the column there. All right. Oh, eight dollars. All right. Just gonna rebet here. Nineteen partial win. So close to fifteen. Yeah, fifteen would have been good, thirty-two would have been better. One, no, not 35, dang, horrible. Three or 12, come on, I was right there. All right, new dealer, huh? All right, so we got two partial losses in a row, so we're just gonna double it. 12 would've been good, three would've been good, 26. Come on. I just added a dollar on zero just because there's a new dealer. For some reason, it's usually around zero. And 15. All right, we got something on 15. Told you, always around zero. Not always, but most of the time. Come on. Let's get a combo hit right here.
Tumble hit. 20. Nope. Dang. One. We needed one. All right, 22, 22, let's go. Let's go, 22. That's what I'm talking about. All right, up $9. I am supposed to go back to the original bet, but I'm gonna stick with this one more time. Come on, back to back. We have here eight. Nope. Dang, come on, twenty three or ten. All right, let's go back to two twenty five section. Good, 12 is good. Better than 28. Yeah, better than 28.35 for sure. Come on, let's get that 26.32. Fifteen three, come on. Oh, zero, <laughs> dang that. All right, we took an L there a little bit. It was around that section. Yeah, the original strategy doesn't cover any zero, or it doesn't cover the zero, but I don't know, 26 and 32, you know. All right, let's go back to the same spot. But uh, 26, 32 this time. 33, all right, 33, pretty good. We'll take that. One would have been way better. All right, run it back. Come on. Give us a combo hit. Street and column. I think we only hit one of those once. A while back. 10 is good, yes. That's what we want right there. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Come on. All right, let's go back to back, come on. Here we go. 28. Nope. Oh, dang it. Come 
come on, 23. Feeling 23 right here. 2310. 22, 22, we'll take that. Let's go. Big hit right there. Come on. All right, come on, back to back. Hook us up, 22, two. Yeah, round two would be nice. Then we can also hit 25. Oh no, it was just on 22 again. Dude, nine is a big L. Dang. Look at that. In between 31 and 22. That's why the numbers are set up that way. All right, come on, we need this. Day nine was super bad. Zero. Oh my god. Got something on it, but man, taking L, so. That's a 108. Lost a little bit there. Starting to think I gotta add one more chip here. Alright, come on. Thirteen is good. Yes, thirteen. Come on. Come on, 31. Thirty-one, fourteen. Thirty-two, we take thirty-two. Let's go, thirty-two. All right, I think we hit the goal. But we're twenty dollars away from making three thousand because we start off with two hundred dollars. Let's go. I don't know why when I press the second column it does that. Come on, one more win. is good. Oh, I messed up over here though, but it's still good. I got lucky there. Let's see. So we won three dollars. I messed up there. All right. Now we're fifteen away.
บอลเธอก็สะทวีตูนายน์เดนเดนวันเดนวันสูวิน Oh my God! In between 31 and 22. I mean, the strategy is pretty cool, but it can get pretty boring since you just pretty much uh, have the same bet, and then that was a complete miss. So I'm gonna double it. Come on, we need this right here. Combo. We need the combo right here. This guy's calling for 11. I want 11 as well. 25, 25. Let's go. We take 25 all day. Let's go. All right. 3,200. Let's go. We officially made $3,000. Um, not sure if I should even uh, do a session number 30. I mean, it was a $3,000 challenge, and we did it. Hey guys, if you made it this far, I want to start off by saying thank you. Thank you for tuning in every week. Thank you for all the advice and thank you for all the support. Without all of that, I don't know I would have made it this far. This was a fun and at times a stressful challenge. And like I mentioned in the intro, you guys can already tell by the title of the video that I decided to stop the challenge after this session. I felt like I didn't need to do the last session to prove the point that I was trying to make. And that is you can make money playing roulette. You don't have to be an expert or a professional gambler because I'm not. Just start by setting small goals for each session like I did. Try different strategies until you find one that works for you. Don't play for too long because the longer you play, the casino usually wins. And most importantly, be patient. Don't try to win it all back with one big hit. And one more thing, if you guys enjoyed the video, if you guys enjoyed the challenge, please do me a favor and drop a like and subscribe to the channel and I'll see you all next time.